men. There are some men? Coming towards the cow. All right. But the cow is like afraid. Can you see yourself? Yeah, I, I feel like so f bad for the cow because I feel like I already know what they're going to do to it. Mm -hmm. I want you to take a quick look of yourself. Are you a male or female? I feel like I'm a... Like I'm a young girl. Alright. You're wearing like a tank top. And my uh, my hair is up, mm -hmm. but um now they're taking the cow like mm. oh, to this really horrible place. Mm. Tell me more. Oh my god, he's taking him him or her way, but it's like the cow's looking at me back. It's like asking like for my help, but you know like I can't do anything about it. Mm -hmm going towards the guy. I'm following the guy and the guy's looking at me weird like he doesn't want me to follow him. Mm -hmm. But he's pulling the cow by 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 like a rope. Mm -hmm. He's gonna kill the he's cow? He's gonna kill the cow. Mm -hmm. And the cow's crying like I see the tear. Mm -hmm. And look at it the cow's eyes and see if um, you recognize uh, those eyes. The eyes are the soul's windows to the soul. If um, mm -hmm. you can recognize them of someone in Carol's life. Those eyes remind me of um, of um, like it looks like it's scared, like it wants my help. Mm -hmm. Connect with those eyes and see if there are any messages coming from the cow. Connect with the cow telepathically. You might hear some words. Help me. Mm -hmm. Like it wants to change. Like, I don't know, like, who wants to be rescued? Mm -hmm. Like, sees the world so cruel, like, mm -hmm. it's a nice spirit, like, it, it, like, the cow always had good intentions. Mm -hmm. Try to make the best, you know, try to be nice, but it's been, it's been, it's being taken for granted, so it's, that's what I like. It wants my help. Mm -hmm. What do you do next? So I need to get away. Um, my God, he's about to like kill the cow. Like, he killed? No, he's about to. Mm -hmm. I'm like standing like in front of the cow. Mm -hmm. like, I'm not letting him. Like, How old do you feel? You're I feel like very young. A teen. Probably like fourteen. Mm -hmm. yeah. The 
the guy sees me like vulnerable, like as if I'm just a teenager. Mm -hmm. So this cow belongs to that guy? This cow looks like he's been like a, like a slave. Mm -hmm. So he sees the cow as useless. Mm -hmm. And what made you come here? No, but I just, I see the helpless cow, like, it has nobody, like, mm -hmm. I'm its only hope. Let's go to the next scene. Okay. When you're, when something happens to the cow. the cow with a gun. He owns this cow? It's like he, 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 like he already used the cow for its purpose, now he's just gonna shoot it. Mm -hmm. Which he already did. And now the cow is looking at me. Like, I I'm just seeing it like just end. Like, he mm -hmm. looks very like sad, like, I don't know how to explain it, like, like, how does like this that? make you feel? Makes me want to, like, shoot the guy. Like, I feel bad for the cow, it just stared in my soul, like, I could have done something. Mm -hmm. You feel guilt? I feel guilt, I feel like I could have done something. Mm -hmm. Alright, so you can release this feeling that you know that you couldn't do any better since you were only 14. And also you can forgive this man that he doesn't know what he's doing. And just uh, let this feeling re release them, release this negative feeling. And when you're doing that, you are no longer need to feel guilt. more lighten up, more, Very less heavier. Very good. So now we're going to close this scene and move to a later day of the same life when something happens and has a meaning to that life. So be there. Later on, um, where? Um, no, later. I'm still talking to that man. You're still at the scene. Yeah, I mean, oh. I, I mean, I feel like I just like. Oh, right, days, go ahead. Talk to the man. Days have passed by. You no, know, the man's talking to me and he's telling me. I feel guilt for what I do. Mhm. Mm but it's just like, this is my life. Mm -hmm. And look at his eyes and see if you recognize them.
I'm not really. Uh... All right. So, and also you can tell him that you will forgive him. And that will make you feel better when you can let this go. I told him that I forgive him. It's just this is not the way um, life should be. There's mm -hmm. always way more than that. Mm -hmm. How do you feel after you told him? I feel like I'm helping him. And it's like helping me as well. Mm -hmm. and like a relief tension. Very good. And how he's reacting to your work? said like thank you like like he he's just leaving that place mm -hmm. where he's going oh, well he lives like in a farm like in a very like spacious like farm mm -hmm. there's like Nothing, just plain farm grass, mm -hmm. like wheat, like the wheat. Like. Mm. All right. But he has a he has like a truck. He's he's just leaving. I feel like he's just gonna find what he what he's gonna do. So where is the the cow? He's just the cow's just dead, like. He left the cow there. Like he doesn't take the cow. No, he just left the cow. Mm -hmm. What was the purpose of this shooting? I don't know. I feel like he just he he feels lonely. He felt lonely, so he felt like his purpose was just to do what he gotta do. And I don't know why the cow was just there. The cow had nothing to, he was angry. Mm -hmm. So now I will go, like, go to the cow. The cow is not alive. But go there and see if, if you can communicate with the cow's soul. Just talk to the cow. Tell me how you feel when you're doing so. I feel like it feels like I feel like it knew that I, I had good intentions for the cow. Like I feel like um it's not like you for like the cow forgave me, but it's like um like it's there with me because you know I was his only only person that was there. No matter what, just to stand up for the cow. Mm -hmm. You can touch it and then talk to the soul. And tell him that you did. The soul, the soul of the cow told me, I love you. I love you. Um, told me thank you for just fighting for me, even though it's just a little bit. 
but I felt that it was the most amazing thing. So. Mm. And you can also ask the cow, what do you are supposed to learn from this event? to try my very hardest even though I can't. Even you know, try your try very best. Try your best even though you think you can. Mm -hmm. And I'll receive love. Repeat. Um, try, always try your best even though you think you can't. Mm -hmm. Like, in other words, I feel like it's trying to tell me like, do your best, you know, no matter what, you always receive love. Mm -hmm. And ask the cow if the soul, ask the soul if um, the soul is your spiritual guide. I don't hear no response like I'm asking. Mm -hmm. I don't hear no response. Keep asking. How you can get guidance. My ego keeps getting in the way. Mm -hmm. It's like it's telling me, like, mm -hmm. it's like getting in. The, it's like something's telling me, like, like. What is that? It's like, a, like my ego keeps getting in the way. Like, mm -hmm. you can you know what to what to do with the mm -hmm. ego? just connect with your guide and ask for guidance ask how you can receive guidance No response. Mm. Why? All right. So just close this scene. And I'm going to take you to a, another day of that life when something 
important happens and has impact to their life. I'm going to count one, two, three. On the count of three, you'll be there. One, we're moving forward to a lane, another day. Two, we're getting there and allow image to come out. And three, you I'm are pregnant. I remember this day. How old are you there? I was pregnant with my daughter that day. What, what is how people call you? I remember myself. I was um in my um in my boyfriend's basement. No, that was the day I was like, I believe I was 36 weeks pregnant and mm -hmm. that me and him had like really bad relationship. Mm -hmm. Tell me more. What reminds you? And I remember that day clearly. I was, um, it's like I didn't want to, I don't want to have her mm -hmm. because I, Things like he made me suffer so much, so. So what I did was, um, I, I, I was screaming hard, like, in, like, inside, like, I, I, I hear myself screaming. Mm -hmm. Tell me more. Why you're screaming? He hurt me so much, like, emotionally, like, his words, so, I believe that day, like, I felt so much, so much guilt in myself. This is which life? Like, I felt guilt where he, like, I remember, I think we were fighting, mm -hmm. and, like, I hated myself so much because he just didn't treat me right, mm -hmm. and I did so much for him. I remember scratching, like, I was like, um, my belly, like, I had a bump, and I was just like, mm -hmm. like, just scratching, like, like, not, not because I, I didn't want her, just scratching, like, just like, like, squeezing my fist, like, scratching, like, mm -hmm. I say, like, why, like, why, 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 why? Mm -hmm. Yeah, and... Now I want you to intensify this feeling, just make it even stronger. And tell me how that makes your body feel. Like I smell the room. You say one more time. Like I smell the room, I in that room I smell like the pain. You smell the pain? Yeah, like I've I I remember that room that I was in that he lived in. I was in the corner of the bed mm -hmm. and I was just crying because I just wanted him to say I'm sorry mm -hmm. and to apologize for hurting me like mm -hmm. with his words. Mm -hmm. Is this uh, Kelly's life? Yes. Alright. And just feel, let it, this feeling become even stronger. And really feel it and see how that does to your body. It makes my body like squeeze, like I felt like I've been squeezed. Mm -hmm. So I was, what I was thinking was like, mm -hmm. why, why did I do this or why did I? Why did I wanna, why did I like connect, like why do I have a child with him? Mm -hmm. Like after he hurt me so much, like 
So when you are feeling this way, is there any words to describe this? Torture? Mm -hmm. Weak? Mm -hmm. And like empty. So let it come out. Let it come out. And then you really feel them, feel them even more, and then I'll release them. Let them leave you mentally and physically. Let those emotions Let them go to the universe. And how do you feel now? Less tension. Keep releasing them. And feel those emotions are leaving your body. Slowly. You don't have to hold down to them anymore. Send it to the universe. You can even give it to me. Release them. And keep doing this. If there's any left over, energy, those negative emotions, and let it come out, and drop them. And I feel so much better, mm -hmm. like good, like airs, like I feel like the air is like hitting my face, like mm -hmm. relief tension. Yes, and keep doing it until you feel there's nothing left. You have the power to let them go and tear this contract that you tried. You tried and tried. It did not work. So now you can move on. And you let the other person go. And you free yourself. And keep doing this. And just release. And Free yourself and let all those negative emotions leave you. You don't need them anymore. And you feel lighter. You feel free. And you can feel the joy. I don't know, but something's holding me back. Alright, let's look at that. Take a look of the thing that's holding you back. Where is it? Okay. 
He's saying Kalino. Say one more time. Like, I see him telling Kelly no. Mm -hmm. Is you are saying to yourself? No, like, I hear his voice. Mm -hmm. All right. The voice is coming from where? Back? Top? Left? Right? Left. Right. Mm -hmm. All right, so turn to the left and face this voice. And you say what is from your heart. You can say it aloud. What is from your heart? Follow your heart. And face this energy. This voice is energy. And you have the power to decide what you like to do. You have the option. And tell me what what you decide to do. I, I let go. You say no to the voice? Yeah. I said, I have to, I have to do things on my own. I have to, mm -hmm. um, I said I want to experience my, how I want to experience on myself that I, I mean, I said like, I, I'm going to experience this on my own I want to experience how I w I'm gonna uh, move forward yes like move forward that I can do it beautiful and say that aloud In, and say that I can do it I'm not weak. Mm -hmm. I'm strong enough to face things on my own. Mm -hmm. And I, I will not be alone. Mm -hmm. Very good. And what does that voice is? What the the voice is still there? It just disappeared. Mm, beautiful. So now you freed yourself and you're moving forward and you released all those negative emotions. And and we can put some positive energy to your heart. What do you like? I would like to put it. How about confidence? Confidence in myself. Yes, I let's wanna feel put a confidence. And just visualize that energy, the energy of confidence coming in. It's filling your heart. And absorb it and take them all. And put it in. See your heart now. And this confidence will be with you. Anything else you like to put in? I wanna. Confidence. Um, you want love? I want to be.
be very brave to 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 confront anything. Courage. Courage. Let's put courage. Let's do the same way and just visualize the energy of courage is coming in and you are absorbing it. And finally, mm -hmm. love. Let's put love in. Lots of love. And take them all. Take all the loving energy. And put in your heart. And let's seal it. Confidence, courage, and love. You have them. They are with you. And you can use them anytime. They are your power. And you are courage. You are confidence. You are love. feel very relieved. I feel like I closed that mm -hmm. and put it in a safe place. Mm -hmm. and you are a, a new Kelly. And you don't need to go back. When you change, this change is a total change. It changes your DNA and you don't need to think about the past no need just we move on we move forward and you are going to start a new life From now, from this moment, tell me how you feel now. I feel very lightweight, happy, no worries. Mm -hmm. Like I'm floating, just happy. Mm -hmm. Good, like smell of air. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. So let's keep drifting and floating. Floating and drifting. We're moving with the cloud. With the cloud that you were sitting on and in through time and space drifting and floating floating and drifting to go to another place another time where that we can stop and maybe it's a life maybe it's in a space maybe it's in another dimension that we can look at it what the soul did there and so we can learn more to understand and to help Kelly's this life or to learn 
the purpose and lessons. So I'm going to count five to one. On the count of one, you'll be in this place that we can learn something from. Five, we're going back through time and space. And four, we're finding that place or that dimension, that space. Three, we're getting closer and closer. And two, let the image and the environment become more clear. And one, I can't see anything. Why? All right. That's all right. Do you see any colors? You might be in the space. You might not. I have. feel like. Mm -hmm. um, I'm just floating, but why? All right. And do you feel you have a body or no? No, I feel like I'm just like You're just so floating in the middle of nowhere. Mm -hmm. And describe it for me, this nowhere. Like I'm in, let's say outer space, but it's just like, nah, I'm just like in the I'm just floating in the center. The center of the space? And allow the image to become clearly. And you use all your senses, including your sixth sense, to feel, to visualize. Something's telling me I am loved mm. by a boy. By what? By a boy. What? Mm -hmm. Why is it telling me that? All right, so look for this voice. Or see if then you can feel this spirit. Communicate and say, where are you? Who are you? Who I'm talking with? You can communicate telepathically.
is the voice is coming from. A matter of river. Say. A matter of river. I'm, Say a, I'm in a river. In the river. Inside the river. No, like I am standing on a on a rock, mm -hmm. but the river is flowing. All right. And how you have a body? I have a body, but I see a boy with a white shirt. All right. Like across from the river. Mm -hmm. I, I, I don't know if he's throwing a rock. Mm -hmm. I think he is. He is throwing a rock. Alright. And ask, ask him who he is. trying to communicate with him. Mm -hmm. Are you a female? Yeah, I'm a female. Christian? What? No. He said a real, a weird name. Sarlam? What? Sarlam. Sarlam? Sarlam. Alright. And what else he tells you? I said, what are you doing here? Mm -hmm. He likes the views. He always goes there. Mm -hmm. Because um, just to get away, uh, like just to get out of, like the I don't know. He said just to think, to not think, not think things. Just uh, he likes the view. The view calms him down. Mm -hmm. And what is your name? Marlene. 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 If I call you Marlene, does that res resonate with you? Yes, Marlene. Marlene. All right, Marlene. How how old are you? I'm twenty-two. All right. Tell me how what is how you dress. I'm in um I'm in a white dress. Mm -hmm. I have very long hair, brown, curlyish, very long hair. What's the color of your hair? Um, it's like a dirty blonde. All right. My eyes are hazel. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm very skinny. Mm -hmm. What kind of shoes are you wearing? I'm not wearing no shoes. Alright. Mm. And what ear is this? Sometimes you can see the number. 
1979. Alrighty. I see this boy. I, I like him. Like, hmm. and he so just looks very curious. Like, you tell me how he looks like. He has a white shirt. Um, mm -hmm. he has a bucket hat. Mm -hmm. Um. His eyes are blue. Mm -hmm. um, he's not. He's not no, he's wearing um blue jeans, but no shoes. Mm -hmm. But he, he, he's not looking at me. He's just like mm -hmm. looking at the other way. Mm -hmm. I, I feel like he's thinking about life. And he looks like your age? He looks like my age. Mm -hmm. And can you see his eyes? His eyes are like blue. He's like squinting because the sun is like mm -hmm. facing him. Like it's a sunset. Mm -hmm. And look at those eyes and see if uh, they look familiar. They look so familiar. Mm -hmm. He... And he it looks be. very like I feel his energy. He he's very um he's very um like hard on himself. Like he's very like a person that acts like he doesn't care. But he cares a lot. But mm -hmm. how do you sense his energy? Like I sense his energy like I feel like I know what he's like. I feel like that face he does. Mm -hmm. like, uh, you can tell I, from the facial can, expression? No, it's like I could. I, I feel him, his, his, I'm staring at his eyes, even though he's looking that way, but mm -hmm. his eyes, his, the, the, his body movement, mm -hmm. he, uh, he's very um, stubborn. Mm -hmm. Very a person that acts like he doesn't care. Mm -hmm. What do you like him about? He caught my attention. He's very like he's a he's he has very he has very um he has problems like He, he has anger issues. Mm. He breaks a lot of things. Mm. He threw a rock and he oh. threw it with force, like mad. Mm. So you, you can visualize those scenes? Well, I see him, but he, I don't think he's, he sees me, but I'm like right, or like I'm towards the right and he's, he's like leaning on the tree. Mm -hmm. But he's just throwing the he's throwing the rock with force. Mm -hmm. But I don't know if I should go up to him. I'm going up to him. You know. Okay. And let's move to that scene when you're having a conversation with him. He said, "What brings me here?" I love coming here. You like the, the water? I like, I like, that's my favorite place to go. Mm -hmm. Do that you live is, close? I take, no I don't, but I um, have a bike. Mm -hmm. It's suitable. Mm -hmm. He has problems with his family. Mm. He hates his dad. Mm. His dad treats his mom like horrible. Mm. He hates seeing his mom being treated like that. Mm -hmm. 
he he wishes um he's he's very open uh, opening open minded he mm-hmm. he just tries to escape from the problems mm-hmm. but he wants to run away mm-hmm. I told him I feel the same way sometimes mm-hmm. it's like we have a connection mm-hmm. he's staring at my soul so it's like I feel like he likes me, like, Mm -hmm. he likes me, like, he, he feels a connection, Mm -hmm. he's so nice, he's, well, he's nice to me, I I feel like he's very nice to me, but, Mm -hmm. he said he doesn't want to damage me, Mm -hmm. I, I feel like I skipped to a scene, Mm -hmm. it's like, he said, I don't want to damage you, Mm -hmm. He he's pushing me away, but he because he doesn't want to damage me, because mm-hmm. he's damaged. Mm-hmm. All right, so let's close this scene and let, let's go to the next scene when you are doing something else with him. All right. Yeah. I'm wearing um wearing a. Uh, those shorts where it's like an overall short overalls mm-hmm. it's very colorful mm-hmm. uh, what colors? Uh, they're like rainbow colors yellow mm-hmm. purple orange mm-hmm. um, and where are you pink um, I'm some grass he's coming towards me mm-hmm. Sounds like we've been together for so long, but. And so how how old are you there? I'm older. I'm. Twenty eight. Right. He's older as well. Mm-hmm. He has, he grew a beard out. Um. We live together. Okay. But I don't. But. I, but I'm, I'm not happy there. Hmm. What bothers you? He got angry and he, and he, um, he like punched them. There was this wood and he punched it. He's like, Hmm. he said, he said, um, he said like, oh, like what, like what the hell? Mm-hmm. He's he's very aggressive, mm-hmm. and I don't I don't like that. Mm-hmm. I want to get out of that. Mm-hmm. So what do you do next? I ended up just leaving him. I, I went in a car mm-hmm. while he's asleep. Oh, while he's asleep, you left? Yes, like he was sleeping. Mm-hmm. And I left all my belongings and I just mm-hmm. took the car and I left. Mm-hmm. Because I didn't, I felt like he was gonna, since he's aggressive, he's gonna hit me. Mm-hmm. So I left. And I took the road. It's a very narrow road. It's a very skinny road. Mm-hmm. So I left. Where are you going? I'm going to the city. Hmm. Where is uh, this place? I feel like it's in Texas. All right. I left. Uh, okay. Yeah. All right. So how you feel when you're leaving? I feel guilty, but on the other side, I feel like it's, I'm saving myself from, from this, from the trouble that it could cause, Mm -hmm. but I feel it's like for the better. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. So 
Let's uh, close this scene and let's go to another day when something significant happens that impacts Melanie's life. And there. I'm an entrepreneur. Entrepreneur. I see it in the sign. It says entrepreneur. Say, can you talk a lot? Entrepreneur. Um, I'm wearing um, I'm wearing a skirt, a very office type of skirt, mm -hmm. um, blue with a yellow mm -hmm. yellow blouse, okay. and the skirt has um like the the office um mm -hmm. jack uh how you say it the blazer oh, okay. um. I'm an entrepreneur. I meet someone very nice and kind. He's very attractive. Who is this person? Zach. Zach. All right. He his office is like it's on the right. Mm -hmm. He's very nice. He finds me attractive as well. Mm -hmm. Um. Um. He's. He works in the same. He place. works in the same place as me. What do you do? Um, so you work for this company. I work for this company in the city mm -hmm. of Texas. Mm -hmm. I see Zach. Mm -hmm. um, and but how he looks we, like. He um, his hair is kind of blonde. Mm -hmm. Um, he's very tall. Mm -hmm. He has a whole suit on. His eyes are hazel, like mine. Mm -hmm. um, he asks me out on a date. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, so wait, let's, wait. let's move forward to that date yeah. when you are with him. I'm with him. Um... He um, he touched my hand, mm -hmm. but when he touched my hand, um, I, he came to my mind. Mm -hmm. He came to my mind, like uh, he came to my mind. Yeah. Tell me more. How he makes you feel? Um, so Zach touched my hand and my ex came into my mind mm. and I left because I felt pure sadness mm -hmm. and I went and I didn't want to do this, but um, I was I'm thinking of going back mm -hmm. to where it's like, um, so Solan's place? Yeah, I'm thinking to go back right now. Mm -hmm. What makes you want to go back? Um, I just miss I, the used to feeling like I'm so I'm, I'm I miss being around him mm. being used to him mm -hmm. um I am going to go back to him alright so let's move to that advance the scene and and let's be that scene when you are back with Solomon. Solomon is still living in the same place. Alright. Everything's wrecked. Everything's wet? Wrecked. Wrecked. Uh huh, wrecked. Everything. What's going on? He's by himself. Um, everything looks like he just vanished the whole house like he mm. 
damaged like everything he looks damaged mm -hmm. he looks broken mm -hmm. but I'm just scared to go to him because I feel like he since I left him without saying anything he's he's gonna say something he's very he's the person that has so much ego mm -hmm. but I'm going anyway mm -hmm. I'm here him now? No, I am about to go in. Alright. So, let's see what happens next. He said, who's there? Mm -hmm. I'm just so scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. Mm -hmm. I told him it's me. And mm -hmm. He cried of tears and he and he, he grabbed me and he said, you left me, you left me, mm -hmm. you left me. Tell me to get out. He told you to get out? To get out. But I didn't leave, I'm not leaving. Because mm -hmm. he's hurt, he's, mm -hmm. I want to fix things with him. Mm -hmm. it's like I'm telling him that mm -hmm. I'm just scared that he would have he has so much anger issues that I'm just I don't I don't want to make things worse so I decided to leave mm -hmm. what did he what was his reaction? he's just crying and crying and crying like he he does he doesn't say anything he's just crying like, mm -hmm. why is he crying why? he feels abandoned from everybody mm -hmm. including me mm -hmm. he thought that I was the only one that would actually change him mm -hmm. but he has pure darkness I ended up telling him to let's go to the city and he was stubborn to say no, you could go leave me, but he ended up coming. Mm -hmm. It's life changing. Mm -hmm. We're st now he forgave me and he changed. Mm -hmm. He changed in what way? He, he's, I, uh, He changed, he, he saw a better light, he, he, trying to, he got himself together, looks like he got himself together. Mm -hmm. He took therapy? Mm -hmm. He's a changed man. Mm. Tell me more about his change. He took therapy. He he took um. I say rehabilitate rehabilitation. Mm. Right. He practiced. He practiced um how to maintain how to control his tempers. Mm -hmm. He he wants to create a family, so he did it for it because of that. He want he he wants he wants to have a child, a boy. Mm. So he worked on it. Just he worked on that. You're not. Are you married? No, I'm not married. Um. Mm. But he he saw his he sees he sees his life with me mm -hmm. because the mom I see that he told me the moment that he saw me um, his he felt like a clearer view of the world. Mm -hmm. So 
so he he changed he took therapy mm -hmm. for me and because he wanted to, he wants to have a, a boy mm -hmm. all right so now move advance the scene to um another a later day when you are older and when something happens, be there. The same thing? Uh, another day, when you get older. We have a boy, hmm. Nicholas. Alright. He's he is, he's three years old. He's very smart. Mm -hmm. He's three years old. Mm -hmm. um, we live in a beautiful house. Mm -hmm. um, we, we bought a house. Mm -hmm. Very big. Um, I'm pregnant again. Mm -hmm. But I'm having a girl this time. Mm -hmm. And how is uh, the whole doing? He's great. He's um, working. Mm -hmm. I'm with Nicholas. Mm -hmm. What and is Solon's uh, profession? He's in architecture. Alright. And he called me right now. Mm -hmm. And um, we are, we're perfect, like, we're perfect for each other. Mm -hmm. Everything changed instantly. Mm -hmm. We have a healthy family. Mm -hmm. We, um, he's coming back from work, bringing food, mm -hmm. all of us. He's very sweet now, he changed drastically. Mm -hmm. Like it's like I'm, like he's a new person. A new person, mm -hmm. and he's he's very he he changed everything everything mm -hmm. that I can't even recognize like mm -hmm. him. He changed to the mm -hmm. better. Mm -hmm. He's he's um he's very kind, sweet, and. Nicholas loves his father so mm -hmm. much. Mm -hmm. So his dad arrived, and Nicholas goes and runs to him. Mm -hmm. And now All right. we're happy. I could say. Mm -hmm. I could say I'm thirty. Thirty. 33, 33. All right. Yeah. It's just very happiness, ha pure happiness. Mm -hmm. yeah. Very nice. So let's close this. Mm -hmm. And uh, let's go to the very last day of Melanie's that life. And be there. Manali went back to the river where she was, where she was on um, mm -hmm. her 20, 20s, I, mm. I believe. Or 22? 22, like, yeah. She was, she went back. Why she went back? Because she... That's the start of her life. Mm -hmm. And the best day she, when she saw the love of her life. Mm -hmm. So am I talking to Melanie's higher self? Yes. Mm -hmm. So what a, 
what a penny can learn from Melanie's life. Hope. Hope. Hmm. Tell me more. Challenge. Challenge. I hear challenges. Mm -hmm. There's challenges in life. Mm -hmm. Take a big step. Mm -hmm. What is meant for me is, is what is meant for me. Mm -hmm. For Kelly. Yeah, for for Kelly. What is meant for me will will be my me my. Say one more time. What is I hear? What is meant for me will be my my thing my. How's it again? Take big steps and challenges. Mm, all right. Because what's mine is already mine. Mm, um, what is yours is already yours. Yeah. Mm -hmm. How Don't about be a fear. Ask. Let me ask Kelly's higher self. Kelly has some fear, and she doesn't want to change the situation even though when she feels probably it, it is not the best for her but she is not comfortable with the, those changes what she's supposed to do take big steps mm -hmm. challenge challenge yourself who Kelly can overcome the fear. Believe in yourself. Mm -hmm. Believe in yourself. Don't ever doubt yourself. You're capable of doing anything mm -hmm. you please yourself to do. Mm -hmm. So when Kelly believes herself, that will reduce her fear. Yes. Mm -hmm. Fear, fear is your biggest impact. But you have to be strong. Mm -hmm. You will feel my strong, your strong energy mm -hmm. flowing down, mm -hmm. and you'll know it's right. Mm -hmm. So we stop doubting mm -hmm. and follow the heart. Stop doubting and conquer what you want. Follow your heart. Mm -hmm. And this is uh, something that Kelly can, she has no problem doing it, or she needs, still it's, needs some help? She needs help. She is sometimes very vulnerable. Mm -hmm. How she can get help from her guide? She's been connecting to me. Okay. She can do it again. Mm -hmm. She did it once. She. When was that? She knows it was that day. With a cow. That day she. She was, the the first day she learned how to man, how to manifest and how to. The first day she she, learned how to connect with me. Mm. Okay. The day she was in her bedroom mm. with no noise, mm. she let her fear go and she connected to me mm. deeply. Mm. So that's how she can connect with you? Yes. Mm -hmm. As 
long as she does that, she can get guidance. I'm always there. Mm -hmm. She just doesn't believe in me, but I'm here. Mm -hmm. She can easily connect me, connect to me, mm -hmm. by closing her eyes. Mm -hmm. And and believe in herself just like that day she did mm -hmm. she did it on her own so she knows how to she knows mm -hmm. she's sometimes scared because she feels like some bad spirit might come but mm -hmm. nothing can come when someone mm -hmm. and was she's the, the best option for her when she deals with this relationship she needs to let go mm -hmm. but it's very hard for her and I know it will be hard for her mm -hmm. but she will soon she will get tired because I know she won't listen to me but she will get tired and she and I will show her that there's more to life than a relationship mm, that's not that's not her. That's it's it's complicated for her, mm -hmm. just because they're together. But he is a good man to her, mm -hmm. and he do does love her, but in her own way. Mm -hmm. It's not it's not enough for her though. Mm -hmm. She expects way more. Mm -hmm. And that's why I say it's best for her to let go mm -hmm. because she needs to find the perfect person that will love her the way she wants to be loved. Mm -hmm. she, she expects a lot from him, but she, I know she will do it. I believe in her. Mm -hmm. she, she just needs to pray 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 mm. I'm always here as well so what's the what's the power of praying the power is that I listen to her mm -hmm. and the, I will I'm her I'm her guidance so I'm sent here to help her Mm -hmm. So, I will always be there for her, just like that day I mm -hmm. hugged her. She felt my hug. Mm -hmm. You are Carrie's uh, higher self, or I am. Her, I'm her guidance. I'm her guide. Mm -hmm. I'm always there with her, mm -hmm. no matter what. All right. Are you the the spirit of the, that cow? I am. Not the spirit of the cow. Mm -hmm. But right. I am I am her guide. Right. I am above her. Mm -hmm. She feels me. Mm -hmm. She doesn't need to be scared. Mm -hmm. You are always watching her. Always, always watching her. her. But she needs to tell him how she, how she feels, even though he does not communicate. And, it, and she knows what's best in her heart. Mm -hmm. She needs to, if she feels, if she can't be feeling this way already, she needs to make a change in her life if he's not willing to change for her. Mm -hmm. he has a lot of doubts on her mm -hmm. but he doesn't know that she is she has a pure kind heart mm -hmm. and she's been she's she's been trying her hardest to make the relationship work but mm -hmm. she's slowly letting go mm -hmm. and I am proud of her mm -hmm. so she's doing well yeah, she's taking it way better before than before. Mm -hmm. She is 
more stronger than ever. Mm-hmm. But she just needs a little bit more of strength. Mm-hmm. And I will give it to her. Mm. Very good. And she's also concerned on what she can do to be a good example for her daughter. Just like she proved her dad that she could get her own car, she could prove anybody else she could do it on her own with her daughter. Mm-hmm. So she has no problem. She's raising. very strong. She just has very... She, she feels like she's not strong enough. She feels like she she's not intelligent, but she doesn't know how much intelligence she has mm-hmm. in order to... She can, she can get out to city, and she will move where she wants to move. Mm-hmm. How many lives has she had on Earth? Three hundred sixty-seven. Three sixty-seven, and she had lives on other planets. Mm-hmm. No, she hasn't. Mm. Why she needs to keep coming back so many times? So she learns her lesson on how to love herself. Mm-hmm. She has a problem with loving herself. Mm-hmm. She is very, she's, she's very insecure. He, he makes her feel insecure. Mm-hmm. So she, so she will need to learn mm-hmm. how to love herself. Mm-hmm. So she had a life with this man before. She did a couple of times, Mm -hmm. but that doesn't mean that he's going to be in her life forever. Mm -hmm. I mean, he can change. Mm -hmm. If he really loves her, he will change, but Mm -hmm. if not, she will know when to let go. Mm -hmm. Because no matter what, a man will come. It can be him, but Mm -hmm. it can be another man, but... Mm -hmm she will have somebody beside her Mm. that will love her in her own way everything she has asked for Mm -hmm. she needs to stop trying to change that man Mm. she needs to work on herself and not work on him Mm -hmm. so she likes to kelly likes to bring more positive positivity in her life she does but she she tries to bring more positivity out of others more than hers Mm -hmm. she needs to stop worrying about other people and start Mm -hmm. worrying about her positivity her health Mm -hmm. so she doesn't need to pay attention to what other people do she's been doing that for too long Mm -hmm. been caring for too much people she lost care for herself Mm -hmm. at a point Mm -hmm. and it's going to affect her child if she keeps on Mm -hmm. just thinking of for others she needs to love herself in order for her daughter to in order to show her daughter Mm -hmm. and are you the one who made Kelly contact me to do this session I made her look at a YouTube Mm -hmm. And I made her go deep in the sense of spiritual mm-hmm. world because she's she already opened the door. Mm-hmm. So no. her conscience told her to look for people like you. Mm-hmm. But she was very unsure to to do this, but she did it, mm-hmm. and. She will hear this, Mm -hmm. and I hope she knows that I'm here with her. Mm -hmm. I'm here everywhere she goes. Mm -hmm. Do you have a name? I don't want to say my name. Mm -hmm. She will find out on her own, Mm -hmm. but she will have another session. She will have another session? Yes. 
me? With you. Mm -hmm. And she needs to find out more? She needs to find out more. She was... She's, she was very... She was very unsure for the session. She felt fear. Mm -hmm. Not for you. But what she... What I would tell her. Mm -hmm. And there are a bunch of people are calling her. This is, this is supposed to happen mm. because she needs more guidance, mm -hmm. but she's slowly, she's opening herself more to the spiritual world and that's what she needs. Mm -hmm. She's a person that likes to find out more, investigate, mm -hmm. but she's doing the correct thing. Mm -hmm. And how about, let's say, psychedelics? And those can help her as well? Or? She is very concerned with psych psychics. Psychedelics. Psychedelics. She, she's not sure if that's good or bad. Mm -hmm. But it's not bad at all. Mm -hmm. The thing is, she just needs to believe in herself. Mm -hmm. She, the thing is, she needs to learn more about herself and mm -hmm. stop mm -hmm. worrying about others' mm -hmm. happiness, how to fix that person. Mm -hmm. She needs to fix herself. Mm -hmm. So that's what everyone should do, always focus on themselves. Focus on themselves. Oh, of course you could care for others, but you need to focus on yourself. Mm -hmm. And... Before you want to help others, you need to make make sure you are okay. Mm -hmm. Make sure you are you. Mm -hmm. Because if you're not full, if you're not full of yourself, how are you going to help others? Mm -hmm. So you have to help yourself first before you help others? Yes. What makes you made her uh, decide to to come to earth at this time and at the you know, to choose this, this particular life. What she she was learn. on earth before. Mm -hmm. What she, she likes to learn this time. This time she needs to work on self-love. Self she was mm -hmm. self-love is important. Mm -hmm. And she is she's misguided by that. Mm. People always talk about um, self-love. What's the best way if someone asks how to have more self-love? What, what do you can say about this? You should look in the mirror. Mm -hmm. Tell yourself that you're unique. You're you. Mm -hmm. And always tell yourself all the good things that you are. Mm -hmm. I am loved. I am beautiful in my own way. Mm -hmm. I am confident. Mm -hmm. Always look at yourself every morning, mm -hmm. every night. Mm -hmm. We are loved by whom? Besides uh, our guides, who else are always loving us? The person above you. Hmm. Can you be more specific? The person that everybody has misguided from. God is always there. Mm -hmm. Even though people people forget about him. Mm -hmm. So he's always there. We're always being loved by the Creator. Yes, by the Creator, God. Mm -hmm. He's always there. He He thanks you for doing these things because a lot of people are misguided in this generation. Mm -hmm. He's very upset mm -hmm. with a lot of people. 
He's upset because um, people are not doing the things they're supposed to. He's upset because people are not are not relying to him. For mm -hmm. instance, people are not saying, "I need God. I need." I need guidance, I need God, they're not reaching out to him. Mm -hmm. and people need to enter the spiritual world. Mm -hmm. So if God is taking care of everyone, how he can really pay attention to every single soul? That's up to him, he knows best. Mm -hmm. I'm here for her. Mm -hmm. I have a purpose to be here for her. Mm -hmm. So you are assigned to her? And it's, it's not an assignment. It's more like I need to help this helpless soul. Mm. and need to fix her and make her better. Mm. To face the world. This world that we are in. Mm -hmm. We need to, we need to learn how to cope with it. This is a very hard and strange world nowadays. Mm -hmm. This generation is very, very, very damaged. Damaged by? By the humans that do damage to one another. Mm -hmm. And it's been worse, it's worse than Israel, Israel. So it was now, it's even worse than before? Yes. Mm. How, how, what do we, what's the, the damage? How human beings are damaging? Humans are killing each other, killing family. Mm. Humans are damaging the planet, are misguided by God. Mm. So why this happened this way? There's, there's people that are working that I have reached for the, for the, per, for the, the person down there. Mm -hmm. So, don't, don't let miss, don't let, don't let anybody misguide you. Mm -hmm. Because little by little, this world is, is relying on the par the, the man of down earth. Can you explain this part a little bit more? What, it, what's, what's, happening to earth the earth is becoming blacker and blacker because of the man down there who are has those reached men? souls are you talking about negative energy negative energy has taken over the world hmm. so where are they coming from it's not where they're coming from it's who how it's the man that down there, I don't, I wouldn't love, wouldn't like to say his name, but mm -hmm. I know deep in your heart, you know who I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. He reached souls. He's granted them materialistic things. So now, little by little, people are getting misguided. Mm -hmm. So this is, this man is, they are human. The man down there was human. Mm. But they carry negative energy. He is negative energy. Mm. Now how, what we can do with this? Rely on God because you, sooner or later, time will come. Mm -hmm. You will hear the bells and you'll know when it's time. But in the meantime, mm -hmm. just
just rely on God and help mm. people out. Mm. There's so, poor souls that are getting are misguided by the day. Mm. So this uh, pandemic is uh, is this a, a catalyst for Earth to shift? I think he's, I, uh, well, I'm Kelly, mm, but, right. yeah. So the guide is gone? I, I feel like he's gone. All right. Hmm. Um, mm -hmm. I feel a relief tension. All right. What else do you feel? I feel more open to myself. Mm -hmm. Very good. Uh, sorry. Uh. Just relax. Keep relaxing. Uh. I feel more better. Mm -hmm. I um I I heard everything. Mm -hmm. I I was a little afraid. Um, yeah, Kelly. So so tell me about the part that um as I asked you to release all the negative emotions, uh, and then I was so filled uh, with love and confidence and courage. At first, I felt like a heated moment, like my body was feeling very hot. Mm -hmm. Um, I felt like, um, I was, I was floating, but I was floating very, in a very hot air where I was stuck and I wanted to get out of that feeling, but I didn't want to let go. So mm -hmm. when you told me, like, like, let it go, it felt like the, when you told me to let the love, courage, and confidence come mm -hmm. in, it's like a wind that went inside my heart and mm -hmm. it's like going in and going in it's like a powerful feeling where you just feel like um when you said confidence like i felt like a very strong boost mm -hmm. like that energy and when you said love it felt like a very warm um type of feeling where it just flowed very slowly but it felt it felt very calm and just a hundred percent sure like mm -hmm. you're doing it and when you told me like you know close it like it was this very strong feeling where your body is just like sinking down but in a good way where you're just like sinking down till it closes like mm -hmm. till it close like your heart closes so it was a very mm -hmm. very powerful feeling i mm -hmm. felt like i had power mm -hmm. towards my head i felt like i had six senses where i just felt all that power go inside me and just mm -hmm. I shielded in me and um and then after I shielded in I just like you know I just spread out like spread out and just spread my arms out and just felt all that wind come. You let it, your body or uh, heart to absorb. Yeah, that. I absorbed it like for a good like five minutes of that feeling going in and in like. A very calm um, warm feeling just you feel like you're flying in this like in this in, like, in the space and you just you feel you can fly yeah you mm -hmm. feel I feel like I was flying not flying mm -hmm. just like like there in the space just flying out mm -hmm. until the top 
low energy. Mm. So when you uh, see those love or courage and confidence, do you see any colors? I saw yellow for confident, mm. purple for courage, mm -hmm. and uh, pink or red. Not pink, red. Red, red for love. So much red, like a deep pure red. Mm. I saw, and uh, it felt very it's like unexplainable. It's like you you see it in your in your head, like you see the way the it comes rushing into you mm. each feeling when you told mm. me love it went very smooth but love confidence and courage went in quick but very powerful at the same time mm. yeah very good to hear all right thank you